Hello once again. Welcome to Verbling at www.verbling.com. I'm Teacher Oakley. Hello. And uh, for this English speaking class, we're going to have a little fun. We're going to practice asking questions, asking and answering questions. We're going to play a little game called What's My Line? Okay. In English, we often use the phrase my line to describe our, for example, our line of work. What's your line of work? I might ask. Uh, so, uh, what's my line means uh, basically what's my job? The uh, object of the game, one person, I, I will probably start, I will be it, so to speak. I will imagine a job or a sp very specific type of job, okay, and then uh, you will ask me questions, of course, in English. You will ask questions to try to discern exactly what my job is. Uh, okay, that's the idea. So you're going to be asking me basically closed-ended questions, not completely open questions, uh, such as things about, you can ask about tools, uniforms, income, education, uh, location, all these types of things to figure out what job I have. Welcome to the class, Heidi. Hello again. Okay, hello. Hi. Uh, th like 20 questions, like that? Like 20 questions, exactly. <laughs> exactly like that. Very, very similar. And except the 20 questions, it may be, of course, animal, mineral, vegetable. In this, it's going to be a job or career that I'm thinking of. Hello, Victor. Uh, how, hello, have you, okay. how have I'm... you been? <laughs> I'm good, thank you. Wonderful. Nice to see you thank again. You for asking. Uh, I also nice to be in your class. Nice to see you again. Yeah, great. Uh, okay, and hello to Ming again. Welcome, Ming, to the class. Hi. Hi, teacher. Hi, yeah. class. Hi, good hi. Good to be back. Okay, I am going to uh, think about. Oh, I'm, I'm going to really torture you, people. Yeah. I'm going to think about a job. Uh, I have a job. Thank you guys. Good luck. Okay, I have a job. You have to guess what it is. And the first one to guess wins, and then they can choose a job. Uh, ladies first. Heidi, what's your question? Hmm. Is it oh, the job for a female? Uh, it doesn't matter. Okay. Male, female. Okay. No difference at all. Victor, your question? Uh, is it office job or not? Uh, no, not an office job. Uh, we, Ming, yeah, go ahead. Do you deal with people face-to-face -face a lot in this job? Perhaps, but I don't have to at all. Okay. Not necessary. Good question. Uh, okay, Heidi. Are you sitting in front of a computer? Definitely no. No. No computer involved. Well, it's possible a computer might be involved, but not necessary at, a, at all. Uh, okay, Victor. Uh, uh, do you uh, uh, do you change places when in in your job during the job? What do you mean by or, that? Or you uh, or you have uh, um, one place for job, or you moving like driver, for example? Oh, okay. Yeah, uh, one location. Yes, one location. Yes, I would be in one location. Okay, I understand your question. 
yeah, there's no need for me to travel anywhere, even out of one room. Mm -hmm. Okay, good question, though. Okay, I, once I understood it. All right, Ming. Is it an indoor job or an outdoor type of job? It, I, I, I believe it might be possible to do it outdoors, but I think most people do it indoors. Okay. Yeah. Indoor job. Okay. Heidi. Do you use some tool, tools? Uh, I suppose I would have to use some tools. Yes. Uh, do you? Uh, oh, uh, Victor. For, for, yeah. For your for this job, do you, uh, do you need? Uh, learn some uh, a lot or you can start uh, work on every every people which uh, want to work on this job can well, I, just start just want to start I understand you thanks uh, I think you would need minimal training not a lot but definitely you need a little bit of training at least you it's not like, okay, sweep the floor. Everyone would know how to do that. You would need some training. Okay. I don't think it would last, need to, need necessarily be a long training, however. Okay. Uh, Ming. Uh, what was the question to Heidi's? Uh, what was the answer to Heidi's uh, question? She asked if I used tools, and I had to think about it, but yeah, there, there would have probably logically yeah there would be some tools involved I think I have a guess can I just say it now sure that's a yes or no question that's a closed-ended question you, you sure. is it an editor oh again you your connection broke up janitor janitor no okay. not a janitor. Okay, I would like to welcome Juan. Hello, Juan. Hi there. Hello. Hello, everybody. Hi, Juan. Hi, how are you? Juan, uh, do you have a... Do you have a microphone? I, I can't hear you. You don't appear to be muted, either. You don't hear to me? Juan, I can't... Hello. Okay. Hello. If you can get your audio up and running, just give a shout out, say hello, so that I know that you can participate. In the meanwhile, we're playing a type of 20 questions game where what we're trying to guess is what's my line? What is my job or occupation? If you'd like to uh, ask a question, I suppose you could type it in the verbling chat box. Hi, Juan. I can see you. Hello? Hello. Hello. Mm, can't hear you. Sorry. You can hear me. You can hear to me. Sorry, I, Juan. I try. You can't hear you Hello. right now. You might have to adjust something in the settings up in the top of the Google Hangout, perhaps. Mm -hmm. You may have to go out and come back into the room. Sometimes that works. Okay. okay. Sorry, uh, Heidi, your question. Uh, do you work in a group? Work in a group. <clears throat> it is possible, but certainly not mandatory. In fact, I believe probably most people do not work in a group. Uh, uh, do you make some think, things? Uh, or, or it's... Uh, mm, it's it's job uh, which don't uh, provide yes. something. I make a product. Yes, product. Good. Good question. And yes, in fact, I do make a product. Excellent. Now you're getting somewhere, Ming. Do you make uh, Do you make an electronic 
product? Absolutely not. Okay. Okay. Uh, Heidi, and once again, Juan, if you get your audio, please shout out so that I know you can participate. Okay, Heidi. It's very difficult. Yes, it is. Making something. Making something. The product is small. Um, compared to? Compared to? Compared to a molecule, it's enormous. Um, Com compared to the earth, it's tiny. My compared head. to what? <laughs> my head. <laughs> your head? How big is your head, Heidi? Because of my head. <laughs> compared to my head. Uh, okay, the product I make could be, in fact, the size of your head. Could be oh. bigger, could be smaller. Truly, it ranges in size from quite small to quite large. Mm -hmm. A meter, maybe. Mm -hmm. Not huge, it's not the size of a car. That would be really weird, but. Not as big as a human. Uh, Say uh, two centimeters to one meter in size. <laughs> Length. Okay, Victor? Uh, this product, is it food? Is it food? No. Good, Victor, you have good questions. <laughs> no, it is not <laughs> edible. Ah, wait a minute. Okay. It it wouldn't kill you if you ate it, but you really shouldn't eat it. Uh, okay, Ming. Um, it the product you make is it uh, something you wear? No. Okay. No. Uh, okay. Uh, hi, Ken. We'll, 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 uh... Yes, hello. Hi, Ken. Welcome to the class. We're playing What's My Line. Everyone's asking me questions to guess my job. Okay. Okay, I read it. No, no need to uh, work in the office. Uh, not face to face. And uh, another way. I no need to uh, use computer. And uh, uh -huh. outside or inside, mm -hmm. both okay. I see. Both okay, but probably inside. He is making something, product. Product yeah. is um, sometimes bigger than my head or smaller than my head. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not food. And uh, what's that? <laughs> Not electronic. <laughs> no uh, electronic. Okay. You get a uh, uh, job. And I can work independently. I don't need to work in a group. It's possible to work in a group, but I can do the job by myself. Okay. Thanks, Heidi. Okay, Ken. Hey, yes. Got a question? Uh, uh, Handcraftman. Is it handcrafting? Yes. Ooh, Ken, right oh, really? away. <laughs> right away, yes. It is handcrafted. I am making a handcrafted product. I am handcrafting. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, Heidi, your question. Uh, does the product move? By no. It has no moving parts. Uh, Victor. Uh. Uh, this product is uh, very important for people. Or not? Yeah, well, that's very relative, but I pretty much guarantee it's not definite, but I would be willing to bet that every single person in this class has this product in their home. Oh. Uh, so, it's common. 
Uh, is it necessary? Mm, okay, that's really relative. In certain situations, it may be. Okay. Usual day to day, no. Uh, Ming. Um, is the product some type some type of kitchenware like china or cut cutlery? No, uh, no, it's not any kind of kitchenware. Okay. But I bet if you have this product, it's in your kitchen. Mm. Oh, no, okay, maybe. Uh, maybe other places as well. It could be anywhere in your house, actually, literally. Absolutely mm. any room in your house. Okay. Uh, okay. Ken? Mm -hmm. uh, are you making carpet? No. Mm. Not a carpet maker. Heidi? Uh, is it made of metal? No metal at at all. My turn. Yeah. Uh, wh whose turn? Who's Victor. My, my, yes. Victor. Yes, it is. Uh, uh, is it product uh, for uh, maybe for decoration or uh, the Often. people? Uh, it has it has ut a utilitarian function. It is useful, but probably most people are familiar with this in their household as a decorative item. Oh yes, yeah. I, I I know maybe what's broad. Okay, well, be quiet till he comes to your your chance, Ming. Okay. I think you do too. Are you a carpenter? Carpenter? No, not a carpenter. Ken. Mm. Uh, are you making uh, how, how can I say table furniture? Furniture maker? No. Hmm. Heidi. Yeah. <laughs> I can't guess. Hmm. Is the product hard? Sorry, your volume is very low. Is the product hard like a table? That's better. Hard like table. It is not as hard as a table. No. No. It is. It's not hard like a table. You could literally make. You could literally scratch it with your fingernail. Uh, okay, Victor. Do you have it? Uh, I think it's maybe flower. Flowers, no. Oh, no, but you're getting really close. A flower arranger or or a flower seller? No. Plants, maybe not. Nope, no plants. <laughs> not plants. Oh, I thought you had it, but, y you know, it's very funny because <laughs> you're really close and you don't even know it. Ming. Uh, are you a curtain maker? Curtains, no. Curtains, no. Not curtains. Uh, Ken? <laughs> Are you making perfume? Perfume. No. Nope. 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 <laughs> wow, I got you. You guys are really stumped. I'll give you a clue. This would have been an extremely important job in olden times. But now it's more like uh, it is a job, and there's people who make money doing this. It's much more kind of, uh, I don't know, whimsical. Not necessary, but, you know, I'm making decorative products, so. Are you a painter? No. Not painter. Were painters essential in the olden times? I don't know. Vic because they didn't have any pictures, photos. Oh, I see. You're okay. Okay. All right. I get. I understand your logic. Okay. 
Victor. Uh, uh, is it product need care care uh, uh, if uh, or I can uh, just put it, this product or, and uh, forgot about that but or uh, this product need care about uh, no. about it no you buy it you stick it somewhere and you forget about it okay yeah no maintenance, no upkeep. Okay, uh, Ming. So you buy it and stick it somewhere and forget about it. Yeah, okay. And again, sometimes it's decorative, sometimes it's utilitarian. If it's decorative, you put it where people can see it. Um, uh, it's are you uh, like a vase vase maker? No. <laughs> okay. Think about that. Okay, where you put a vase, where you put uh, flowers. What else do you see decorating people's houses? Ken. Mm -hmm. What else? Sculpture. Sculpture? No, no, not, not a sculpture. But something that also has a function. Oh. Heidi. Furniture maker. No, we already did furniture maker. I'll let furniture. you. I'll let you have another one. We are. We already did that. Oh. Uh, I don't know. I asked that. Uh, as is this product you people usually put on? Mm, Tables, uh, yes. Or, or tables, yes. Yes. Sometimes in the center of your table, dining room table, where you're going to eat. Oh. <laughs> Ming. You right Middle please? of your dining table, right? Sometimes. Candle maker. Are you a candle ah! maker? <laughs> ta -da, ta -da, ta -da. Candle maker. Candle maker. Very good. Wow, that was a tough one. Yeah. Very difficult. <laughs> Very difficult one. And yes, there are people who make decorative candles or scented candles that smell nice. People put candles in their bathroom to smell like cinnamon, get rid of bad smells, in their kitchen to have a romantic dinner. On the mantelpiece, you may see sculptured candles. So they're really everywhere, right? If the power goes out, you light a candle. So they have functions. <laughs> that was a hard one. Ming, very good. Okay. okay. Tough one. All right, Ming, your turn. You have to think of a specific job, some type of okay. employment. And then we will ask you questions. Okay. Um, give Obviously. me a second. All right. I want to Google this job. So. Okay. <laughs> It'll do some research. Okay. I want to make sure that the the word is correct. Right. Okay. 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 I got it. Okay. Okay. Ken, uh, please, you can have the first question. Okay, uh, well, uh, uh, yes or no question or uh, some other question? Yeah, yes, no question or maybe yes, oh, okay. no question or or it can be is it inside or outside, you know, like that. So that's oh, still a closed-ended oh, question. Closed-ended question. Okay, Sorry? Can I ask uh, where, are, where are you uh, working? Uh, I work uh, in yes, the beer yes. factory. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you working? Try to be more specific. Do you, what do you mean? Okay. What country are, are you, you working are, in? Are you working in the inside or outside? Do you work in an office building? Are you working inside or outside? Yeah, that's perfectly okay. Uh, you work inside. Inside. Okay. Uh, Heidi? Are you making something? 
No, you're not making something. Uh, do you work with people or by yourself alone? Okay. Uh, you you can work with people or you can work by yourself. Okay. My turn. Uh, mm -hmm. Victor, be careful about peoples. Peoples. Right. People. Don't say peoples with an S, uh, just people. People is plural all by itself already. Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, so, uh, do you provide a service for people? Yes, you do. Excellent. Okay. Ken. Uh, can you get a tip from your job? Keep tips tip from customers. No, no, no tips. No. Tips for a job well done. No tips. Okay, Heidi. Uh, do you use a computer? Yes, you use computer. Okay, <laughs> Victor. Uh. Uh, do you uh, uh, do you uh, draw something in your computer? Draw means you. Do I draw something? Yes, yes. Draw. No, no drawing, no drawing, no drawing. No drawing. Uh, does your job require you to speak on the telephone? Um, maybe I think all office jobs require you to speak on the telephone to some extent. So sometimes, sometimes. Okay. Uh, all right, Ken. Okay. Uh, uh. Do you know uh, many things about computer system? No. Uh, I mean, you have to know how to use a computer, mm -hmm. but you're not an like ex expert, mm -hmm. like a com computer engineer. No. OK, OK. H Heidi? You need to treat? A customer. Uh, I think is no, no, no direct customer, but okay. there are a lot of variants of this profession that you could, but mostly it's called client, not customer. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you don't necessarily interact with clients, although it's possible. Mm -hmm. Is that am mm -hmm. I? Phrasing that? Yes. Right. Okay. Yes. All right. Thank you. Victor? Do you need uh, some uh, some training for do the job? Some pro uh, some skills? You yes, study? I do. You have to study. To uh, okay. uh, for example, do you have to have a college degree to get this job? Mm, yes. Yes, you do. Thank you. Okay, Ken. Uh, does your job relate related to? Is your job related to the laws or trial? No. Uh, mm -hmm. actually, part part of it does, but it's it's not called laws, but more like regulations. Regulation. Mm. Hmm. That's interesting. Is your income is your income higher than common workers? What do you mean? It's I mean the income level is different. Mm -hmm. um, Everywhere. What's common worker? What's the income? Average of your job, the people get can get okay. a good salary compared to some other office workers. It's no. not the highest, yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. So maybe you could phrase it like this. Uh, okay, 
uh, obviously different countries, people average income of citizens are completely different in different countries. Uh, would it be higher than the average income in, wherever it is, whatever country? That may be a way to look at it. Higher than minimum wage, yes. Higher, higher than the but average income, the average house or average. I don't income. know the average income here. So, is is about right. me? It's about the the average income. Well, it's not much it, higher. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Average income. All right. Good enough. Uh, is it a job uh, need to attend uh, some workplace, or you can work uh, like freelancer from your home? Actually, you you could you could, but it's better to work in the office. But you could because because there are uh, like Skype. Or other video chat function, and so you could work from home if you have to. Okay. Hmm. I just had a question. Does it have to do with uh, does your job deal with the aspects of internet security? No. Okay. Ken. Uh. Is your job related to the uh, financial, people's financial, finance thing? It's related to finance, but it's not d directly related to finance. Well, part of it deal with finance, but not completely. I mean, if you, what, what do you mean finance? That finance is such a broad term. Mm. There's so like many people counsel uh, about financial. Issue to you? Well, financial issues. What do you mean, financial issues? It's kind still very broad. How to, how to save money or, you know, how, how to reduce. The yes, yes, yes. Or? Yeah, definitely, definitely. That type of stuff, yes. Okay. Heidi. Um, you are Joe. The workers need to have some certification. Uh, like it's not required, but it's, um, it's better to have a certificate, yes. Okay, uh, Victor. Uh, is your job I need to uh, some specific uh, uh, computer tools? Uh, s some software. Yes. Yes. And uh, no, uh, is this is this uh, software uh, specific or as usual like Word, Excel, or is this, is it specific uh, tools? Specific to the uh, to the job like that. Yes, for right. your job. Yeah. Okay. So are you asking me if if I if if the job requires Microsoft Office software? No, that's very broad. There's, you know, there's 10,000 jobs that use Microsoft Office. Yeah. He, he's asking if you need very specific software programs to do that job, and that job, really, that job only. Very specific? No, there's many types of software. Mm -hmm. And different yeah. people use different softwares, not just one specific software. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Uh, okay. Um, let's see. Do you? Oh, do, do, do. Uh, are you trying to help your clients make money? No. 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 Okay. Can. Uh, are you an uh, are you a financial advisor? Well, <laughs> no, you're not. I would hope if he it's was, very close, he's, very he's trying to make money for his clients. <laughs> <laughs> I would hate to have a financial advisor that's not trying to make money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, Heidi. 
uh, your job uh, related related to the numbers. Yes, it's related to numbers. Uh, if your job need um, advertising. Uh, in does my job in involve directly involve in advertising? Oh. Is that what you mean? Uh. Victor, do you do you mean it? Uh, your job your job need advertising for. Um, okay. Are you saying that the company he works for does it advertise? Oh yes. Is that what you're saying? Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, I think every all all company needs some type of advertising. Hmm. So I don't know how to answer this question. Maybe. Probably. Maybe. Most likely. Yeah. Uh, okay. Mm -hmm. uh, well, I'm totally lost. Uh, okay. Uh, I, oh. Um, do you work for the government at all? Or do you work for private? Uh, well, I don't. Some type of this, some variant of this profession works for the government, okay. but mostly you work for for uh, your company. Okay. Uh, I can't. Uh, are you an accountant? Wow. Yes. There you go. Oh. Ah. Got it. I thought so. <laughs> <laughs> so I asked you are related on the number. Okay. Okay. Uh, good job, Ken. All right, Ken, you're up. You oh, gotta okay. figure out a. Yes. I yeah. I decided. Career. Okay. You're Paul McCartney. No. Kidding. No. <laughs> <laughs> kidding. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Heidi, your first guess. You you were next up. Mm-hmm. Okay. Your your first question. I'm sorry. <laughs> guess. What question? Question. Question, I mean, yeah. What is your job? <laughs> <laughs> How old are you? Uh, what is your weight? Uh, your, <laughs> your job requires to send uh, some Pen? room. Pen and room? <laughs> mm. um, yes, usually, yeah. What was the question? I, I missed it. Is his job uh, required to stay in a room? Oh, uh, in a room. Uh, yes. Okay. Victor. Uh, is it physical job or uh, it's uh, not physical job? You just can sit and uh, do your job. Mm -hmm. Yes. Uh, usually, uh, yeah. It's a non-physical job. I, I don't need. Uh, I need to use uh, brain. Mental. Mental. Okay. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Uh, yeah, Ming. Uh, do you need to use your creativity in this job? Mm, somewhat creative, you know. But uh, it's not like a creative, like an art artist. Okay. Okay. Uh, is it related to the medical field at all? Uh, no. Okay. It's not uh, mm, usually, in general, it's not related to medical field. Okay. Mm. It's possible, but not usually. Okay. Uh, Heidi. Do you use computer? Uh, yes, I'm, I'm use, I use computer. Okay, Victor? Uh, computer... Um, you... Uh, um, 
uh, you should uh, guess hard or you just may, uh, do some um, mechanical job, for example, type something or you should guess mm -hmm. hard. Yeah, I need to type uh, sometimes, but uh, I don't need to know so much about the computer. Uh, okay. Ming? So you don't need to know much about computer. No. Okay. Mm. okay, let me think. Do you um do you work by yourself? It's up to the, the person. Yeah, some person uh, work freelance as freelance, and some person belong to the company. Uh, I mean, work by yourself as in, do you work in a team or do you work alone? Usually working alone. Okay, okay. Uh, okay. Public or private? Is it in the public sector or the private sector? Public meaning your your government is, the your paycheck comes from the government. Mm -hmm. I think usually it, uh, it's a commercial. Uh, commercial. They're working as commercial company or freelance. All right, thank you. Uh, Heidi. Uh, do you need some license or such certification? Uh, some of them have, but some of them might not have the certification. Mm. Do you make some electronic products like software? Or uh no I don't make uh I don't make uh, physical stuff. You make physical stuff yes? Uh no no. <laughs> okay. No products okay Ming. Are you an architect? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Not an architect. <laughs> okay. Uh oh, oh you uh okay. All right, let's see here. Uh, um, mm -hmm. oh, uh, is your job? Do you um? I'm assuming that since you have no products, you must be a service. Is your service for? Mm -hmm. Is it B to B or B to C? Which is a fancy way to say are your customers businesses? Mm -hmm. or uh, consumers, individuals? Uh, kind of, uh, I, I provide a service to, uh, that, that mean, what do, do you mean, business, something? Businesses are your customers, so whatever you're selling, businesses are your customers, actual businesses. As I'll opposed to individual Tom, Dick, and Harry off the street individuals. So is uh -huh. so okay. Okay, maybe I'm selling mainly. I sell. Uh, we're selling uh, our service to the individual customer. Okay, all right. And just so you know, since we're learning English, these are common business terminologies: B to B, or B to C. Mm -hmm. C for customer, consumer. Uh, okay, Heidi. About your income, is it higher than common uh, uh, employees? Mm, I'm not sure about it, but maybe average income, I guess. Average, around average. Yeah. Okay, Victor. Uh, uh, and your <coughs> is your job has uh, some risk maybe you can broke something or uh, um, I, I don't i don't broke anything by my job or you have some insurance <laughs> uh, usually, uh, the, maybe insurance is not necessary for this job. Hmm. 
Okay. <laughs> For example, in my job, uh, uh, can, can I say a couple? Of, uh, yeah, please. About my job. Uh, in my job, uh, when I I'm a software engineer, mm -hmm. and when we deploy some new product, mm -hmm. and uh, and some and if happen in some uh, difficult situation and mm -hmm. broke something, we can roll back. On previous previous version and everything is work. You understand? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Some uh, uh, the the way I way of I'm using computer is just open open the software and uh, providing service. Okay. <laughs> okay. So yeah, doesn't have to worry about all that. Okay, Ming. Do you talk a lot? Do you deal with customers? Ooh. Ah, you yeah, I used to talk a lot to the customers. Uh, okay. okay, that was my question, Ming. Okay, are are you a call service representative? Call, call service? Yeah. Meaning, uh, mm -hmm. you talk on the phone and talk to customers. Uh no, I'm using software to talk with my customer. Oh, I see. Okay. Heidi. Do you need to sell something? Uh I need to sell service. Service. Not not uh uh stuff. <laughs> okay. Uh Victor? Uh uh, yes, I guess. And do you? Um, uh, I don't know. Uh, do you need um, to? Um, uh, your, uh, when you work, uh, do you need to prepare something for your customers, and then you you ju you you uh, for example you in first you meet f with your customers, then you prepare some service, then you again uh, meet with your customers, or uh, your customers can just tell call you and you uh, provide him your product. You just, uh, uh, which you need pre uh, already prepared. Do you understand? Ah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. I need to prepare. The, yeah. The, the some uh, hmm? some products uh, uh, according uh, uh, according uh, single provider, or single customer, or you just have already prepared. Uh, ah, right. Okay. We we can actually in English we can express that as um, is your product or service off the shelf, meaning you buy it as is. You don't need a consultation. You just yes or no. You want it or you don't. Uh, as opposed to other perhaps services which have to be uh, you know modified to fit the circumstances of the customer, right? Is that what you mean, Victor? Yes. Okay, so we have a phrase off the shelf. Okay. Okay. Can I? I need to prepare uh, before I provide a service in general. Some mature person uh, can provide a service without preparation, but usually we prepare this uh, for the service. I think I, I know what it is. I think I know what it is. Really? Go for it. Yeah. It's your turn. Is it? A, is it? Verbling teacher. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, yeah. Maybe I think yes, it's yes because I saw it <laughs> online teacher. So online teacher. Okay. Oh wow. Okay. <laughs> I was nowhere near guessing that. Oh boy. He said you use software to talk to people. Then I thought maybe it's uh, verbling teacher or something <laughs> teacher. <laughs> okay. Yeah, off the shelf. <laughs> Not exactly. Okay. Oh, funny. Okay. Uh, excellent. Um, Ming's already had a shot. We we got like five minutes. Uh, Victor, Heidi, one of you guys want to give it a try?
Yeah, okay. Uh, well, maybe okay. pretty easy. Okay, all right. All right, Heidi, go, go ahead. In that case, uh, Victor, I'll give you a first, first question. Uh, <laughs> are you a driver? <laughs> Are you are you a driver? Well, what? Very close. Very close. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Ming, what's your question? Okay. Indoors or outdoor? Indoor. Okay. Okay. Ken? Uh, are you a taxi driver? Uh, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, are you a pilot? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. The fastest one ever. <laughs> wow. Okay. All right. Looks like everyone gets a shot except poor Juan who's stuck silently. Sorry, Juan. Uh, Victor. We still got five minutes. If you want to uh, come up with something, do you have an idea? Okay, right. okay. Uh, it's pretty easy. I think pretty it's easy. most most easy. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Ming. Indoor or outdoor? Uh, mm, mm, usually indoor, and they. It's better if indoor. Okay. Yeah. You're a pornography star. No. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Ken, your question. Oh, you do. Uh, uh, are you uh, provide a service for customers? Uh, um. That yes, 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 but yes, but uh, uh, the customers need very need uh, in my service. But uh, if they uh, uh, is if uh, the customers uh, need in my service, it's something bad happening. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Did you understand that answer? Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Uh, yes, it's, it's a provide server. Um, yes. Provide a service, but it's kind of an emergency service. Yes. Okay. Uh, okay. Heidi. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Not in my service. Not in sure. Are you are you selling some object? Uh, no. Okay, no product. All right. Uh, is it related to the medical field, your job? Yes. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, okay, Ming. Here, are you a surgeon? Uh, surgeon? No, I don't know. What do surgeon is a doctor that performs operations or surgery. Uh, no. Mm, okay. Uh, okay. Ken. Uh, do you have a patient? Patient? Uh, yes. <laughs> okay, and I. All right. And I assume you mean patients like people who go to a doctor, not patients like, I'll wait. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> Although those two words sound exactly the same patients, mm. patients. Okay, uh, Heidi. Are you dentist? Yes. <laughs> yes. Okay, that was fast. Woo, Heidi, winner. Okay, very good. Well, that was way too fast. By the way, uh, what are... Uh, okay, um, obviously, uh, we already did me. Can did, all right, verbaling teacher. Victor, you're a software engineer, is that right? Yes. Okay. Ming, what do you do? Are you a student or are you working? I'm an accountant. You're an accountant. You really <laughs> are an accountant. 
Okay. <laughs> okay. Very good. Heidi, uh, as we know, you're a professional actress. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. I knew that. Uh, and Ken, you're in, you're in school, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Okay, just checking. All right, uh, we're about out of time, but thank you guys for showing up and thank you for playing. And Juan, I'm really sorry that we couldn't hear you. Um, I don't know. You might have to make some adjustments or contact help in uh, on the ver verbling page. Just look in the lower left-hand corner. There's help down there. Uh, but uh, thank you uh, very much, and uh, you guys have a great weekend. See you next time on Verbal. Bye. 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 B